Hey there, fellow comfort seekers. Welcome back to Product Critique, your go-to channel for honest reviews on the latest tech and lifestyle products. Today, we're diving into a chair that's been making waves for its comfort, adjustability, and wallet-friendly price tag. Stick around as we unravel the SIHOO Doro C300 and see if it lives up to the hype. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into the world of the SIHOO Doro C300 chair, a seat that promises comfort and customization without breaking the bank. Let's get cozy and explore its features, build quality, and the experience it offers. Right off the bat, I must admit, I'm impressed. The SIHOO Doro C300 doesn't disappoint when it comes to comfort and adjustability. And the best part? It doesn't demand a premium price tag. Sure, some of the materials might not be top tier, but considering the affordable cost, it still feels sturdy and supportive. My lower back is certainly thanking me for it. Now, let's talk about assembly. Admittedly, the sight of that massive box in my hallway was a bit daunting, and I let it sit there for weeks. However, the actual assembly took around an hour, and that includes a couple of blunders that should have been avoided. The instructions are relatively clear, although the illustrations could be improved for smoother guidance. A noteworthy aspect is the labeled compartments, each containing screws, shims, and other bits, all individually sealed. As a self-proclaimed scatterbrain, this organization was a lifesaver and ensured a smooth setup process. When it comes to design and build quality, the SIHOO Doro C300 exceeds my expectations. While it might feel slightly plastic wide, the mesh webbing stands out as a premium feature, springy and more sumptuous than what's typical in mid-range chairs. The light color palette adds a touch of elegance, a departure from my old black chair that my daughter thought resembled a robot spider. She's relieved with the softer appearance of this chair. Brace yourselves for the comfort level of the SIHOO Doro C300, it's nothing short of astonishing. The lumbar support bar, nestled inside the chair, offers a snug and cushioned feel. It cradles your lower back in a comforting embrace, and since using this chair, my lower back pain has significantly diminished. Let's talk adjustability. This chair is a master in that department. Moving the entire seat up and down, as well as adjusting the armrests, is a breeze, just pull and release. No need for multiple confusing levers, trust me, that's a relief for someone who forgets lever functions. The armrests can even swing out to the side, keeping them out of the way. Some reviews mentioned they found them overly mobile, but personally, I appreciate their flexibility, especially in enhancing my typing posture. Tweaking your seat height is done through a lever under the seat, although it can be a bit fiddly. However, adjusting the seat back forward and backward is smooth. Just pull the same lever and lean back, letting your weight do the work. The neck rest is a delightful surprise as well. It moves where you want it to, offering actual support. You can adjust its position forward and backward, even tilting it to your liking. Returning to the mesh. Oh! That sumptuous mesh. Its springy and supportive nature sets it apart from typical chair mesh. The cloud-like comfort it provides is a considerable improvement, especially compared to my previous SIHOO chair. The SIHOO Doro C300 is the embodiment of value in the mid-range chair category. While not all materials are premium, the sitting experience is undoubtedly premium grade, all thanks to clever design. With an RRP of around $349 per 349 pounds, you can often snag it for even less on platforms like Amazon and other third-party retailers. Keep an eye out for the latest deals. Wrapping up our exploration of the SIHOO Doro C300, it's clear that comfort and affordability coexist harmoniously in this chair. If you're seeking a chair that delivers on lumbar support, adjustability, and cost-effectiveness, this might just be your next go-to. Thanks for tuning in to Product Critique. If you found this review helpful, remember to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe for more insightful reviews. 
This is Product Critique, signing off. Until next time, let's get comfortable and productive.